Hi, it's Feltus Angel, and it's April 29th, 2015, and um, I hope I'm in focus. I'm back to using my Samsung uh, camera, and let's see if it actually takes a clean picture. It's so kind of weird. I don't know what to expect. Um, anyway, um, so what's up for today? Not a whole lot. I just got off work, and so I'm probably going to take a nap. Um, and uh, that's pretty much it. <laughs> I'm done for the evening, except for watching videos and editing videos. So that's that. Before the last day, I wanted to tell you guys a little bit about the web series that I am working on. It's called The Kid Adventures and basically it's a lo-fi sci-fi action adventure story about uh, six, six different clones that um, basically save the universe. So uh, we're at the story right now uh, with Agent Mayhem as one of the clones. The, the first scene of of the first episode she wakes up and she doesn't know who she is and she doesn't know where she is and so she's already being um, sent on a mission but she doesn't know what she's doing and that kind of that's where it starts when I say that it's a lo-fi sci-fi story that means basically that lo-fi is like a low budget low technology low production value not because we you know we can't afford it but because we want to keep it to inspire the imagination if you will it's sort of like a kid in a cardboard box pretending that they're a race car driver or an astronaut I mean I was that kid there will be a lot of behind the scenes footage that will be on the chan on this channel and also a lot of um, you know whatever DIYs I can come up with I have this cute I mean, I don't have a DIY for this particular item, but I'll show you. This is like something I made out of cardboard. This little spaceship. Pew! I mean, I love this stuff. <laughs> I won't, you know, DIY this, but there are other things that I could DIY. Um, I forgot how I made this, actually. If I'm so inclined, I might actually make another one. I don't know. Maybe I'll do special requests, you know, if someone asks me to, to make something. I, I began writing the story back in 1994, I want to say. Around 1994, I wrote the story. And it actually, you know, it's just something I've been writing a little bit, little bit, little bit by little. I believe I finished it in... Uh, in 2000 and it was about 800 pages but it it was just one story of one clone and there is so much more that I added over the years since 2001 and it just it keeps it keeps building and building and building and it's like an it's it is a never-ending story really because there are so many places and areas you could go in this kind of universe that I, I developed. And I hope that you'll stay tuned and watch the me grow um, as a YouTuber and as a, 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 as a, a filmmaker. When you see the trailer, and which I hope you've already seen, and if not, please check it out. When you see the trailer and you see the first episode, you'll see that I, I've done everything I could do at the time. And the cool part about it is that as the episodes go on, the more I'll learn about new effects and more tricks I'll develop as a filmmaker. And it's just going to keep growing and growing. Another thing that's really important to me about the series is that I really want it to be something that everybody can enjoy and that's probably why this channel is probably is most likely not going to have any like curse words or any bad naughty words in it because not because I'm not edgy and stuff like that it's because I want it to be easy to consume 
Uh, but I mean, it's already it's already weird and niche, right? You're not gonna have a lot of people interested in this particular thing in sci-fi, lo-fi sci-fi. I mean, when people think of sci-fi, they want like big special effects. They want computer graphics. They want it all. They want it. They want to feel like they're actually on the planet and they're really in the spaceship. And they want the lights to be blinking. And they want they want all this like supernatural you know realism and i i'm not gonna give you i'm gonna give you if there's something that looks real trust me it's like really out of being an artist and being creative it is not designed to totally make you uh think that for one minute that this is a hollywood production or there's more than one person working on this effort at all it's just me um, and you know, I'm hoping later on I have more people working with me on this project, but there might, you know, the honest truth is there might not be. There, it, it might just be me for a long, long time. Of course, this is going to take time, and I hope that you will bear with me. I will be doing vlogs in the meantime, so I will not stop doing vlogs. They must. I I realize now I must do vlogs in order to keep people up to date and. And inter you know not just interested but let them know like hey I'm still working on the project I haven't forgotten it you know here's what I had to do today and maybe something sometimes I'll be able to show things um, and sometimes I won't be able to show things because then I'll give away the story so I gotta you know gotta kind of weigh it all out so that was what was on my mind today April 29 2015 see you in the next video.